car bomb targeting soldiers killed five people and wounded 68 others, including 30 soldiers on Thursday in the Kurdish-dominated city of Diyarbakir in southeast Turkey. Authorities said a bus transporting troops was passing by a five-star hotel when a remote-controlled car bomb was detonated. Though no one has claimed responsibility for the attack, the Turkish leadership immediately blamed separatist PKK Kurdish rebels who have carried out bombings across the country in the past. Two high school students who emerged from a building where they were taking preparatory courses for university exams and three other civilians were killed. The explosion shattered the windows of surrounding buildings and the sound of the blast was heard from some two miles away. The attack appeared to be a retaliation to three airstrikes by Turkish warplanes against Kurdish rebel shelters in northern Iraq last month. The group is said to use strongholds in northern Iraq for cross-border strikes. Maalesef Diyarbakır'da terör yine kanlı yüzünü gösterdi ve dört vatandaşımız şu anda henüz kimlik tespitleri netleşmiş değil şehit oldu. 52 yaralımız var. Bu 52 yaralımızın altısı şu anda gelen bilgilere göre. The attack will likely strengthen the position of Turkish generals who want to hit back hard against the PKK both in Turkey and in northern Iraq.